Hello, uh, Jack Foley here, uh, just in my third sphere account. Um, just want to go through some basic things that you have in your account at your disposal. Basically, all these um, different um, applications here are, are fantastic. You have to go through, like, there's, there's an abundance of information in your account that you really have to do. Is that uh, your web hosting options here? That's where your file manager. Uh, where you can go into all that sort of stuff, redirects, subdomains, park domains, all that sort of stuff. Here's where you can change your websites, whichever. Uh, if you want to use Bleepsoft, if you want to use uh, the other two uh, web editors to, to change your website or make changes to your website or even build a website from scratch. You have an autoresponder also here. You have website statistics wherever you can, you can see where your traffic is coming from. The affiliate program here shows you how much you, how many people you're bringing into the system, how much you're earning. Uh, automation station again. Um, I think it's got to do again with the autoresponder, um, building your own articles, that sort of stuff. Um, you can create your own ebooks, um, web traffic center. Like you read, like the amount of different. Um, stuff in the actual uh, your account is, is mind-boggling up here in the top left I am use I have used 67 megabytes there's 500 megabytes per account uh, that's why I actually a lot of the videos that I make I actually uh, host them on my account in YouTube because basically I'm not paying for that um, I'm paying for this so I want to you know get as much mileage out of my megabytes as possible I have 432 left um, and I think I have about four or five websites on my account so it just gives you the idea of how many websites you can have on your third sphere account and still not go over your your band bandwidth usage or your, your disk space I just want to go in here and show you um, the Bleepsoft editor which is which is fantastic um, basically uh, you don't have to know any HTML to operate this. You can build websites in a matter of hours, in, in less than an hour. You can you can make changes to your websites extremely quickly. Uh, I'm going to work on my main domain. I have um, also subdomains on my account, but I'm going to work on my main domain here just just to uh, show you um, how I make changes and that sort of stuff. So if I just log in here, it should bring me to my um, my file manager and from the file manager I'll go to my main homepage file which is index.html okay I'm just waiting this to open um, it's just taking a while Okay, here we go. If I go down, it's they're all in alphabetical order. All of these files are on this domain. So, like, and I have index test, index one, all that sort of stuff. So basically, if I want to test out how a home page looks, first of all, I'd save it to one of these web pages before I'd upload it to my main home page site. Okay, if I press edit here, this would bring me in to basically my home page, and basically. From here, from time to time, I make changes consistently, um, depending on offers from affiliate companies, depending on that sort of stuff, where to place my affiliate websites, um, all that sort of stuff. And the great thing is, is it's so easy um, to do it, and so quick to do it. You can just, you can basically change your website, in, you know, in a flash. What you got to be careful of is that you do a backup. Uh, they say you should be doing it every time you before you work on your site and I probably agree with them to be on the safe side I don't personally I probably do it once once every two two weeks something like that but definitely before I make big changes on my site I would always do a backup to ensure that if you do make mistakes that you'll have something to fall back on if I go in here just say to this one and I want to change the affiliate link on this that's actually the mom, my mom's XX um, affiliate link Basically, what I'm showing you here is the importance of, you know, the window opening. Basically, the affiliate program opening in a separate window. Very important. So basically, if I put in whatever www dot massive um, dot com and go blank. Okay, and insert link. Okay, 
on the house they're not going to save this but basically the important thing there I'm illustrating is the blank which ensures that the affiliate program will open in a separate window you really need to and check 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 your links to make sure that your website opens in a different window before you do any mass advertising because you're just wasting your time because people will come and they'll be gone from your site just as fast so make sure you do that there it is blank insert link okay okay and I'll just shut that down so again like basically with bleep soft like I can you know cut I can get rid of that and I can put it somewhere else I can put that banner somewhere else there's no need for HTML I can put that up at the top cut that out of there you know it's just so like it's it, it's basically like copy and pasting it's like paintbrush you know which is fantastic and basically what you see is what you get and yeah, like the code here for the HTML is here if I go into view code again important when you want to put in maybe JavaScript that sort of stuff or you want to put in Google Ads or that sort of stuff um, but for definitely for 99% of the time you don't need to be in here you just need to be back out in the actual um, in the actual sorry about that in the actual um, this and everything should be fine okay